Endocrine disruptors are chemicals either man-made or natural and when absorbed in the body they can mimic the body's natural hormones or alter the natural production of hormones. These chemicals are linked with developmental, reproductive, brain, immune and other problems. They are found in many everyday products including some plastic bottles and containers, liners of metal, food cans, detergents, flame retardants, food, toys, cosmetics and pesticides. People may be exposed to endocrine disruptors through food and beverages consumed and pesticides applied and cosmetics used. In essence, your contact with these chemicals may occur through diet, air, skin and water. Some common endocrine disruptors are bisphenol A, BPA which is found in plastic food storage containers, dioxins which is released in environment during wildfires and burning, phthalates used to make plastics more flexible and they are also found in some food packaging, cosmetics, children's toys and medical devices. Phytoestrogens which are naturally occurring substances in plants that have hormone-like activity such as genistin and diazin that are in soy products like tofu and soy milk. Triclosan, which is found in some antimicrobial or personal care products like liquid body wash. Endocrine disrupting chemical exposures even at low amounts can lead to health problems like ADHD, decreased immunity, increased risk of diabetes and metabolic disorders, premature breast development in girls and abnormal breast development in boys, affects fertility and reproduction and lastly cancer. Few tips to avoid exposure to endocrine disruptors are number one, reducing the number of different cleaning products you use. Consider making your own from simple ingredients such as vinegar, lemon juice and sodium bicarbonate. Number two, do not preheat or heat non-stick cookware to very high temperatures. Today's non-stick and Teflon cookware is considered safe for everyday home cooking as long as temperatures do not exceed 260 degrees Celsius. There are components namely PFAS that are not fully understood. Number three, do not use plastic containers to heat food in the microwave. Microwave friendly usually refers to the heat tolerance of the plastic and not the food safety. Number four, avoid canned foods and whenever you can avoid food packaging. EDCs can hide in non-stick pots and pans, so cook in stainless steel, ceramic, stone and cast iron instead. Lastly, store and drink water from glass bottles and steel utensils. If you like our videos, please hit on the bell icon so you don't miss out on our posts.